السلام عليكم ورحمة الله In the endodontic literature there is a limited data available on post-operative pain uh, resulting from calcium silicate based root uh, canal sealer uh, and also uh, there is no study comparing the effects of a calcium silicate and calcium hydroxide based sealer on the post-operative pain uh, so the uh, my paper today is talking about the effect of calcium silicate and calcium hydroxide based root canal sealer on post-operative pain it's a randomized clinical trial uh, done by Turkish group uh, she's a um, mine bucker and her group uh, the aim of this study uh, is to compare the post-operative pain level changes uh, resulting from using calcium silicate and calcium hydroxide based root canal sealer in mandibular first and second molar with the uh, with the uh, symptomatic uh, apical periodontitis uh, they they have a 60 patients with symptomatic apical periodontitis and were randomly allocated to uh, to two groups the first group is uh, 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 you, they use a single uh, single cone uh, get a with the uh, the calcium uh, calcium uh, calcium silicate based sealer and the second group uh, they use um, lateral condensation technique and uh, calcium silicate uh, calcium uh, calcium hydroxide uh, based sealer, root canal sealer uh, and uh, they evaluate the post operative pain between uh, the two groups uh, in uh, at 6 12 24 48 hours and on the three, five, and seven days, they use a visual analog scale. Uh, and the results of this study show there is no statistical significance between the two groups. Uh, and also, there is no statistical significant difference in, uh, in analgesic intake between these two groups. Uh, Post-operative pain, not related to age, gender, or smoking habits, uh, also, the pain level evaluated at multiple time intervals using uh, visual analog scale. Uh, the limitations for this study, uh, first of all, is uh, they compare uh, two types of sealers, but they use a different type, different uh, obturation technique. The second uh, second critique for this paper is the is the evaluation of pain. And as we know that the pain is is uh, a subjective uh, is subjective, so we cannot uh, even uh, evaluate it using um, uh, statistically using uh, different type of uh, tests. And uh, thank you so much for your listening.